Hi everyone. Today I want to share with you three keys to building your confidence. But first, story time. Years ago, I was in a job where I was young and I was low key, constantly worried about my performance. I didn't know if I was doing a good job. Now looking back, I see I did a great job, but at the time I kept seeing where I fell short. Well, one day I shot, edited, and produced a video and our contract videographer saw it and they were impressed. And then I noticed something. For the rest of the day, I fed off of that energy. I didn't have the same worries I usually had when I sat in meetings. I felt confident. I was giving myself grace and space, all from the energy of receiving a compliment that I didn't expect. Now, I can't depend on random people to compliment me to fill my tank or to recalibrate my self-worth. But here's what I can do. I can control the story of myself. I can call upon and remember those feelings to reignite them. So here's what I offer to you. Number one, keep a portfolio of compliments. I try to save every nice thing, um, any kind of feedback that I get, whether it's through email, text messages, I have a file where I throw all that stuff. Um, there was a time I had friends when I turned 30, they made me a book about 30 reasons why we love Sheena. I was astonished that they took the time to do that. But there have been times where I've been feeling down and I look through that book and it reminds me of who I am and that I have people supporting me. So first thing, save your compliments, whether it's in your notes app, Google Drive, Evernote, whatever it is, keep collecting them. The second thing is in your mind, reframe the story of you. Change the story of you based on the facts from the feedback that you've gotten that's positive. Pull into those positive notes and let that become a huge part of your story rather than focusing on things that have gone wrong. So in your mind, shift the story of you, recraft it. And the third thing is write it down. Write down that story, whether on a piece of paper or on a file in your phone or computer, because when you write it down, it becomes more real, it becomes a part of you, and you get to see the trajectory of your life, where you've been, how much you've actually accomplished, what impact you've had on your community, what purpose you've had, and you get to see and decide where do I want that trajectory to go? What will be the next chapter in my story? By writing it down, you're creating the space to do that. And as you imagine the future and you pull that thread along, it's going to influence your actions, who you who you see yourself to be, your self-concept, and that's going to improve your confidence.